leave the slot machines for slot canyons. Not only is Kanab, Utah surrounded by three national parks, Lake Powell and the Grand Staircase, but Kanab offers numerous hidden gems and stunning slot canyons with varied colors, size and beauty. Joining us now is Jeanette Petros, Executive Director of Visit Southern Utah. Good morning, Jeanette. Good morning. Thanks for having me. I'm excited to be sharing about Kanab today. I know we're excited to get into it. So let's start off where a lot of people might be wondering where exactly is Kanab, Utah? Yes, I would love to share that. So we are three hours from Vegas. We are three miles from the Arizona border um, and we're at the bottom of the state of Utah. Wonderful. Now, what is there to do in Kanab? So we're a small town. We actually only have two stoplights, but that does not mean that we're too small for fun. We have nature all around us. We're surrounded by Zion Bryce, the North Rim of the Grand Canyon and Lake Powell. We also have a lot of our own hidden gems that we love. People love to come and get out of the crowds and spend time out in nature discovering the hidden gems around Kanab. Now let's talk a little bit about those hidden gems. What are some of those must see things when visiting? Well, as you mentioned, slot canyons, definitely. You don't want to miss that. And we're home to the largest slot canyon in the United States, possibly even in the world. It's uh, Buckskin Gulch, and that's a 45 minute drive from Kanab. You park your car, you walk about a mile and you enter the slot canyon, and then you can go as long as you want. You can get a permit and camp on your way. Or what I usually do is get a go take my lunch, go in, eat, and then turn around and come out and make it a short day trip. But slot canyons are a must. The Coral Pink Sand Dunes State Park is here. Uh, we've got all sorts of hikes where you can see Indian pictographs and just lots to do. Well, I love going hiking, so it sounds like a really cool place. And especially for those just looking to sightsee, maybe they're like, I don't know if I want to do the camping. I think you mentioned a couple places that would be really cool to check out. Yes, lots of places. And then we've also got lots of great, delicious restaurants. We're really lucky. We've had some really great chefs come here and want to make Kanab their home. That is so wonderful. Now, talk to us a little bit about this Western Legends Heritage and Music Festival. Yes, that's so exciting. Uh, back in the 1940s, 1930s, Kanab became known as Utah's Little Hollywood, as a lot of those old Westerns were filmed in and around the Kanab area. In fact, over 250 Westerns were filmed right around in Kane County. Uh, so we have this celebration once a year. It's called Western Legends, and we're celebrating the 25th year of it this year. So it's going to be bigger than ever, where we celebrate that old uh, Little Hollywood heritage. So we have a street fair with uh, all the vendors. We have some stars coming, uh, the older stars from that time period. We also have uh, bands. We have a battle of the bands contest that's great. And then we have a legendary rodeo and just lots to do. And you can find out more about that at westernlegendsroundup.com. Absolutely. So before we go really quick, talk to us about that Be Kind uh, to Kanab campaign that you guys have going on. Yeah, that's another one we're really excited about. Uh, Be Kind to Kanab is our way of helping our locals and helping visitors understand that when they come to Kanab, we are a small town. Like I said, we've only got two stoplights. And so we don't have a lot of the amenities that folks from the city might be used to. And so we're just, it's a reminder of how to, how to be when you're in Kanab. You might have to wait a little bit in line at the you know at the restaurant you might have to and, and we're also reminding folks to clean up your trash um and to not carve your name on the rocks and just different things like that oh yeah that's a big one well jeanette thank you so much for taking some time to spend with us this morning and talking to us about Kanab. it sounds like there's amazing and a lot of fun things to do there so thank you Yes, thank you for having me. Of course. Find everything from breathtaking campsites and glamping to family hotels and luxury accommodations. To learn more, head to visitsouthernutah.com.